Hey, it's Christina. I'm a producer and content strategist here with Kapwing, and I've got a tutorial on how to remove the background of an image in a photo using the Chromebook. So Kapwing is a free video and image editing platform. It's online, but what's great is that you can download our app in the Chromebook so it'll appear down in your app folder. If you're a teacher, this is a pretty great tool because your students don't need to log in or create an account to use it. Um, it's all free. If you don't log in, you just get a little watermark in the corner. Most Chromebooks have a touch screen, which makes editing with Kapwing super easy because anything you can do online with your mouse, you can just suddenly very quickly do with your fingers. You can like drag and drop and move files around. So luckily most Chromebooks have touchscreen, but not all. So I'll be using the Pixel Book 5, which does. So I can use my fingers or where my stylus go. Or I can use the stylus, which makes it also very easy. The cool thing about using Kapwing on your Chromebook is that you can actually install this web app as an app. So if you click right here, install Kapwing, and say install. Boom, now Kapwing is down here. You can see it right in your app menus with all these other apps. Oh, got it on there twice. Um, so then when you open it, it will take you to this page so you can start editing right away. Start with a blank canvas. And now you're in. Okay, first you need to bring your photos in. You have two ways of doing that. You can click the upload button right here and drag and drop your files or share a link to the image URL. Your other method is by clicking the images button right here and doing an image search. Let's say I want to take a picture of Alaska the drag queen. So let's take um, this image. Now you also want one that's got a fairly simple background. The simpler the background is, the easier it's going to be to erase it. All right, when you're ready, click the erase button here. And then we have two different techniques. First is the magic wand. Your mouse is now looks like a little target and everything that is of a similar color value that's sort of connect, consecutively connected, it will highlight for you to remove. Now, this obviously selected too much, so that means the sensitivity is too high. So we're gonna lower the sensitivity and try again. That's nice. So hit remove pixels, and then you can just kind of work your way around getting rid of all this white stuff. And what's great is if you're using your Chromebook with a touch screen, you can just kind of scoot around like this. New pixel. Oops. Uh-oh. You have to be a little careful though because you might highlight everything. So if you accidentally selected more than what you wanted, just click in this, um, in this gray area right here. The other technique is to use this eraser. You can adjust the size of the eraser. So if I make it really big, that's gonna get rid of all that pretty quickly. So that's really convenient. You can also make it a lot smaller and then zoom in and get more fine detail up around here. Now, if you are activating your eraser tool and you're trying to move around and you might accidentally erase a part you're trying to uh, Try to keep so you can hit the move tool and that will uh, let you go back to moving around so if you're doing it with your touch screen it's pretty simple um, you can just move around like that let's see what fun things we can put this on How about that? Or maybe Alaska's on a yacht. It's not so bad, right? It's pretty simple. If you want to expand your creative potential, check out more of our tutorials for awesome ideas. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.